guys, how's it going? Doing a quick video to not only test out the new GoPro that I had that I kind of wanted to use to showcase my drive home from school and being stuck in traffic, uh, but I also want to vent a little bit during this test of the GoPro. I wanted to vent on something that is just ultimately irritating. I saw the headline this morning, it was uh, big news within the gaming industry. The next Call of Duty was announced. There's going to be more details, I think, at, at E3, which I think is in the next two weeks or so. Or within two weeks, less than two weeks. Which I'm very excited for, especially for the new Avengers game. It, it, this is definitely the time to, for other companies to shine since PlayStation is not going to be there. So Avengers, uh, whatever Xbox got up their sleeves, Nintendo, that potentially there as well. Really stoked. But, we've gone to a point where shit just needs to stop. Shit just needs to stop. Activision announces the next Call of Duty is going to be called Modern Warfare. It's called Modern Warfare. It's not Modern Warfare 4. It's a Modern Warfare, it's a reboot. And it's going back to the roots of the original Modern Warfare. Which, from that devil's advocate perspective, sure, you know, I, you know, it's not futuristic, but it's not from the, you know, World War II or, uh, you know, a war from days past. It's contemporary, so it's going back to realistic, boots on the ground warfare, on warfare. And I got to slow down up ahead, so I think the, the juggling, although this should be rather stable, so it's something that it is. But it's going to be much more realistic in its gameplay and in its story. I think I saw one headlight saying that it's designed to make you feel uncomfortable because of how it's approaching the themes. Whatever. My point is that we're re it's modern warfare. I even tweeted about this. If you follow me on Twitter, link in the description. At least I'm hoping it's going to be in the description. If not, then I'll just have to yeah, you know, look me up. Twitter slash doc, uh, dot com slash Dr. Spider David. I tweeted saying that everybody, all of us collectively say, you know, people who just are not huge Call of Duty fans can kind of see through the transparency that Activision, they sell you the same game every year. Yep, it's the same game, same game every year. Sure, they, you know, we don't mean it in a literal fashion, but at least we, we just feel like the annualization of Call of Duty has gotten to a saturation point, critical mass. Now, in my, in my tweet, I quoted Activision, quote, the same game, the same game, hmm, end quote. They're literally giving us the same game now. It's not even a, an exaggeration. It's not even a, you know, a joke, a, a running goof. Activision is really selling you the same game. Wow. Wow. And I tweeted that, and I did get a response from a friend of mine uh, who I, uh, I've known since high school. Ironically, his last name is Ortega as well, John. He tweeted saying that, uh, you know, he responded back to me on Twitter saying that he did a little bit of information digging. Apparently, they're even going to use, <coughs> excuse me, similar maps or even the exact maps from that original Modern Warfare game, Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. They're gonna use the exact maps. Really? And possibly even the same source code for those maps in the game. Guys, I, I, I'm gonna use this video as a tool to just implore you. Please, please, please vote for your with your wallet, okay? Use some kind of ration, uh, rationality. At least use the reason in being that maybe this one won't have a uh, battle royale mode, which I actually don't think it does. I mean, maybe they might announce one by E3, but the initial uh, details are that it's gonna have your standard PVP modes and some cooperative gameplay, and of course the story, and it is gonna have a story mode. It is gonna have a story mode, guys. After all, there's gotta be some kind of justification for it to be a redo of Modern Warfare. 
But guys, come on. Vote for with your wallets, please. That's my that's the only thing I can do in my sunset uh, videos, in my sunset videos here on this channel is to say that I like this GoPro a lot and I also want to use it to tell you to please vote for Watts. I'm not gonna tell you don't buy Modern Warfare, don't buy the next Call of Duty. If you're a Call of Duty fan and you feel like you need to get that next version every year, single year, all right, you know, who's, who am I to stop you? But I implore you to really reconsider, considering that they are literally copying and pasting at this point. It's not even a, a joke. They really are giving you a game you bought 12, 13, 14 years ago. Uh, it's been less than that, like about 10 years ago. Yeah, 10 or 11 years ago. I think 12. I think it came out of 07. Repackaging it and giving it to you. Oh, no, again, not giving. They're selling it to you. They're selling it in spades. And guys, like I said, just please vote for your wallets, all right? This is Dark Spider David signing out from the desolate wasteland that is the high desert on my way to pick up my girlfriend so that we can go and, well, I mean, she'll be thoroughly entertained, but I'm going to use this as a way to kind of cleanse my palate from these news of, you know, modern war warfare being repackaged and resold to go see Godzilla. Please, Godzilla bring me to my happy place and sure enough look forward to that review in the very close future hopefully within the next 24 hours until that until then make sure you follow me on instagram twitter and twitch the username is dark spider david i'll see you guys on the next one peace